still acting up like a puppy for my caring. Why stop for? You're kidding. What happened? It's a crazy story. When I was about to go to the city to buy some more fruit, trotting steps sinked in towards my ears. I had noticed it was peachy, but when she dropped into me and gave me some fun-filled love, I thought for a moment checking out the action she's currently doing. Then it came to me stating that she's not the peachy that I know of. But my city experience didn't end here, when I took peachy and myself to a house of a suspicious grandmother. Though I have been told to keep an eye on Peachy after noticing a different personality, I was just laying on the couch until I heard destruction directly from the kitchen. Peachy has led a butterfly in the house while chasing it. I couldn't even believe it. My, she would be as crazy as a real pet would be. After when she heard the whole story, we were both banished from the house as I had to blame on that puppy acting peachy for that butterfly in the house incident, as I never believed it was an accident either. When I had to take both of us back home, peachy was running around the ranch until she found a few dog toys to play with while she's still in action, but after she noticed a ball, she literally stared at it asking for company to play a little game of fetch. I wasn't amused, but had to go for it anyway. However, even without a turnaround to kick, I gave it my most powerful kick, and she luckily ran off as was told. While she is distracted looking for the ball, I surprisingly had a relief in myself. But when Paul came to me asking what's the fuss about and gave him the weird answer, Paul gave out the truth about Peachy acting like a dog as he was thinking that it's just who she is while I didn't believe in the clue. Suddenly when Peachy came back with the ball, she has now made attempts to crash into me every time a game is finished. Unfortunately, her crashing into me was non-stop as she also does the same production even when I was selling carrots in time very limited. The worst was yet to come, as she spotted the carrots in a hungry matter. She poured some carrots around myself and prepares to bite. I tried to convince her but she ended up biting my hoof instead. <laughs> biting my hoof was the last time I took care of that puppy acting peachy. At some point, we need to find a way to get her back into the one kind we met her before. Hey, it's okay. I also don't appreciate her actions either, but we are still friends with her no matter what. Not as I'm hearing. R. Oh hell no. I hope you're not here to crash right into me again. Me. I was good off the whole time.